accept charges, press 1. To refuse charges, press 2. If you would like to... For a limited time, visit an inmate from the comfort of your home for only $5. Okay, Rich Paul is calling me from the Cheshire County House of Corrections, a.k.a. the Keen Spiritual Retreat. Now, in the background, there's Free Talk Live, which is airing now, live. So, it may be difficult to hear Rich. I'll do my best to keep the audio solid. Hey, Rich, how's it going? Not too bad. How you doing? I'm very well. It's good to hear from you. I wasn't able to get through to you all through Porkfest. Uh, yeah, I don't know, uh, I don't know what was up with that, and, uh, I, I couldn't get through to anybody during Porkfest. Yeah, I have a feeling it was just about, uh, people having a poor cell phone connection, so I heard you were just on Free Talk yeah. Live. Oh, you were or I was? You were. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, I sure was. Um, apparently, uh, unfortunately there's a shitty phone here. That, uh, I can't seem to get a good connection to anybody, but it was the only free one at 9 o'clock. So. Well, I can hear you loud and clear now, and I am recording, so if there's anything that you'd like to say, feel free to go for it. Okay. Um, well, basically, I just wanted to uh, check with you on some things. Have any of my uh, blog posts for nhjury.com or for... Uh, uh, freekeen.com actually gone out. I know there is one that went to, uh, I know the one I sent to mail to jail when, but I sent like seven of them. Yeah, the one that uh, went to mail to jail got published to mail to jail at the very least. And anything that you've sent or said to me has gone out. For example, the last we spoke, you read to me a letter that was intended for the Keen city council and I typed that up and um, sent it as a letter to the editor to the Keen Sentinel and the union leader. Groovy. And, and that I very much appreciate. I, I knew that. There should also be, I sent an envelope to Ian and it was a very fat envelope. It had uh, several NHJury.com blog posts. Um, it had one called Ransom Rich Paul that was for freekeen.com. It had a letter for Mariah. And it sounded like, I, I asked Ian about it like two weeks ago and, and it sounded like he had received it, but I don't believe that any of it's gone online. So I was wondering, I mean, I was wondering if we could get him to, to pass that on to somebody who will do something with it. Yeah, um, I will check. I will. I will ask him as soon as Free Talk Live is over, and if he hasn't put it online, I'll go ahead and do that myself. Okay, groovy. And uh, and the NHJury.com ones um, are uh, basically there's there's a collection of them, and I don't really expect them all to go online the same day. Uh, but the idea was that, you know, they maybe uh, one or two weeks could go up um, until they're exhausted. Okay. And, and the only one that's important in terms of ordering is that the first one should be the one that's entitled um, A New Vision for NHJury.com. Okay, noted. And, and that one should go first. Well, you were missed during Porkfest. A uh, celebration of 420 was... Um, it took place, and uh, you you were sorely missed. Oh, groovy. Um, well, that's good to know. Um, how's the uh, fundraising going? Uh, the, fu the fundraising continues to go well. There were some more funds raised for you during Porkfest. That was probably the best event. Uh, for the fundraising effort so far. People can still donate in Bitcoin or the King's Cash at GoFundMe.com slash GoRichPaul. Okay. Uh, do you know how much we've raised so far? I'm, I don't have access to the internet in here. So. Right, yes. <laughs> you know, I don't have a figure on that, and I haven't checked since before Porkfest. Uh, I've just gotten back 
essentially yesterday and have been uh, busy uploading videos and writing blog posts about it all. So, no, I, I haven't uh, checked on that and I will be sure to do that. So, when you call tomorrow at the same time, I'll be ready with an answer for you on that. Okay, great, great. Glad to hear it. And did, uh, I know James Cleveland was going to bring some buckets up to... Uh to Park Fest and put them out. Do you know if he did that? Or? He did, yep, yep. The Rich Paul Defense Fund buckets were passed around uh, during Free Talk Live and other LRN broadcasts in the LRN.FM media room. Uh, there were people who just passed around buckets sort of like it was church, and uh, people contributed knowing, of course, uh, what, what the funds were for. And uh, I did deposit $60 or so, uh, immediately before leaving for Porkfest. So you should have some money in your commissary. Uh, how's that looking? Yeah, that did, uh, that did come through and, and that worked out great. I, I devoted 50 bucks of it to, uh, to phone calls. So, you know, that gives me the ability to call arbitrary numbers out there in the world. And that's really helpful when, when you're in here and it's new. You couldn't do that when you were in jail. Yeah, that's, um, that's huge. Yeah, it, it really is. And actually, I'm, uh, there's a couple of phone numbers that I could use. Um, one is uh, J from Mail to Jail. Okay. And the other thing is, since even before Pork Fest, I haven't been able to get Mariah on the phone uh, at all. And, and it returns very quickly, which makes me think maybe your phone number has changed or something. Okay, I'll check on that. Okay. Is she still around? Yes. Groovy, groovy. And, uh, okay. Um, I'm trying to think if there's uh, any other, uh, any other news. Not really. Not much happens in here. I've been getting some letters from, uh, from mail to jail. That's always nice. Um, I guess, uh, I guess that's about it. It's been a really slow week this week because, of course, everybody was up at Porkfest. So not too much happened. Yeah, I imagine that was especially difficult for you, um, not being able to contact anyone and knowing everyone's away at Porkfest. Yeah, it was it was a little frustrating. I was able to get Cantwell on the phone a couple of times, and that that always helps, even though he's not technically a free stater anymore. And I was amused as shit by the Cantwell hunts that were going on up at Porkfest. He was sitting down here laughing. <laughs> yeah, I was getting a good laugh out of that as well. Yeah, I uh, I definitely would have been up there in a Cantwell mask if I if I'd uh, been able to to get one. Um, oh, and actually, I have a uh, kind of a uh, somewhat weird message for. Um, for Mariah. Okay, I'm and still recording. Should I stop? That, uh, yeah, actually, let's, let's go ahead and stop that. All right. GoFundMe.com slash GoRichPaul to donate to Rich and MailToJail.com to write to Rich. Thanks, Rich. Cool. Thanks, man.